Hi there. This is our Quinn Chia Chinese lathe. It's an older Chinese lathe, but um, uh, very solid um, back then, so it's quite a uh, solid uh, lathe, and um, there's a few of them around, and they're quite popular and, and do a good job. Um, this one ticks over nicely. So starting from the back, it does have a coolant system, but no rear splash guard there. Got the steadies and face plate, etc. You would have seen the photos under here. Missing a knob there. Um, uh, coolant switch. You can hear that pump. I haven't put fluid in it, but that's that pump ticking over. Um, uh, three electrical change gears here, and then your two manual um, changes for the headstock. Um, the, I'll start from this side. Um, tailstock locks working. It's got a bit of slop going in and out um, and might need tightening up there. Uh, but that lock itself is working on that tail stock. Carriage is nice to move. And so is that cross slide. And there's a little bit of movement but not much. Compound slide feels good to move and a little bit of movement in that. Um, the bed condition, you can see that there's um, uh, been a little bit of pitting just where it's set and, and corroded under the oilways under there, but the bed itself doesn't feel worn. Alright, I'll start it up. I've got it in a relatively slow... Oh, that's reverse. It's got, it's got a neutral um, brake. Um, uh, when it's in neutral, that was what was making that noise just in reverse. Um, the brake is just a set of um, brake shoot type shoes around the um, motor pulley, drive pulley. So I've got that lead screw going there. Um, I can change the speeds of all that there and there, so that's quite fast now. And I can um, change that to the feed shaft. So there's the lead screw, feed shaft, lead screw. And same with here, I change the speeds. So that's working, feels good. This is the direction, so that's nice. So I'll engage that lead screw, and it's heading that way now, and I'll send it back towards me. Now it's coming towards me. So that's engaging and going in and out nicely. I'll change over to the feeds, so that's the feed shaft running there, and if I pull this lever towards me, it's sending the carriage that way, and if I push that lever forward, it's sending that cross slide in. So that's pretty much um, all of those feeds. So um, uh, that was 61 RPM, I'll switch this electrical switch to the blue range. And that'll give us 41 RPM, 30. Now I'll change it mechanically to the next range, and that should be 93. 125. 185. Next range, mechanically, I'll change that so that will be 230 next one 300 next one 460 and last range to go and that's 700 950 and 1400 top speed. So that moves through there nicely. Um, it's good with the three um, changes there electrically. Um, it sounds nice and quiet through there. And that is pretty much it.